Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Harry Views back with another video and today I will show you guys 10 unknown iPhone features that you should start using right away on your iPhone. These are features that most of them are hidden and not a lot of people know about, but they are very useful and will make your life much easier. On Safari, when you're browsing and you want to open something on a new tab, of course you tap and hold right here and when it shows the menu, you tap open in a new tab but there is a trick on doing that very very fast all you got to do is just tap with two fingers on the link and it will open it on a new tab the maps app on ios has a feature called fly over so what this basically does is that it allows you to see the cities on 3d but now with ar you can basically walk over the cities Using AR and this feature called Flyover, you can basically turn into a Godzilla and just walk over to the cities and explore them. Right down below in the description of the video, I will leave a link to a website where you can see all the cities in which you can explore like this and have this feature. If you go to your settings app and go to privacy, go to location services. If you scroll down and go to system services and go to significant locations, right here you will have to open this using your face id or passcode so let me just open this using my passcode here so what you will find here is a list of locations that you have visited so right now i have just accidentally cleared all the history here so i don't have anything in there but you should have a list of places like countries and cities that you have visited and if you tap on them you will see a detailed information like streets or places that you have visited you probably know of the guided access feature on ios so if i triple tap on the home button right here it will turn on guided access basically it won't allow me to go out of this app so you give your iphone to someone to use an app you want to lock it here you can do that to unlock it you will have to triple tap again and then enter the guided access passcode and then click right here and but there is a faster way on doing that instead of triple tapping to turn off guided access just double tap and use face id so just double tap and use face id and as you can see guided access has been ended and you don't have to go through all those steps on the lock screen when you have face id enabled you can quickly disable it so for any reason you want to disable the face id all you gotta do here on the lock screen is just tap and hold the volume button each one of them and the power button tap and hold them for a couple of seconds it will show you this menu once you click cancel right here you can see face id will be turned off if you go to your settings and you go to face id and passcode settings actually you can set to use face id for other stuff and not unlocking your iphone so you can have face id enabled for like itunes or apple pay but not for the lock screen so you don't want to use the face id on the lock screen you want to use your passcode then you just go ahead and disable it and you can still keep it enabled for other stuff and if you want to have a faster face id make sure you turn off right here require attention for face id this basically won't require as much attention you don't have to have your eyes wide open and staring at the iphone to basically unlock your iphone just go ahead and disable it right here and it will be much much faster i already did a video on this trick it is pretty awesome it allows you to basically delete all the emails at once just go ahead tap the edit button go ahead select one of the emails tap and hold the move button and then unselect that email and once you release the move button you can see right here it will show you all the messages selected all you gotta do is just tap on the trash button right there and it will trash all the emails on the camera app when you're taking a picture like like an overhead picture just like i'm doing right here from my camera to my iphone you can make sure that there is that is straight so basically what you need to do is just go ahead go to the settings go to the camera and enable the grid and then you will get this plus sign right there so there is a yellow one and a white one so when you're moving your camera once it turns yellow all the way then you know it's straight and you can go ahead and take your picture and last but not least another safari trick so when you go to the tabs on safari and you want to find out the recent tabs that you have closed just go ahead and tap and hold the plus button right there and it will show you all the recently closed tabs 
So that is it for this video guys. These are 10 unknown iPhone features that you should use on your iPhone. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe for more and I'll see you on the next one.